they are all absolute experts in their subject, the bakers and master confectioners of the Eber Cup. For six days at the fair, they identified their best of the best. For visitors at the World Market of Baking, a visit to the glass competition arena was an absolute must. We have seen superb things, products, showpieces, and we are also satisfied with this area. It is really second to none. I can't wait to see what the teams come up with next time. First up was the unofficial World Championship of Bakers. Twelve teams from around the world knew from the outset that solid craftsmanship alone would not be enough to obtain a good ranking. You have to be very creative. You have to be 100% familiar with the subject of baking. It must look good, the products must be innovative, and last but not least, smell and taste really good. René Krauser and Siegfried Brenneis were raring to go for Germany. They had their own ideas about the music for the competition slogan. First of all, we thought music, Germany, classical music. That was our first question. After we mulled it over for a month, we realized that the first idea is never the best. So we rejected that because we noticed one thinks straight away about violins and musical scores. Then we said we need to emotionalize the subject and we turned rock and roll into bread and roll. That's how we put our craft into practice. It wasn't enough to win though, but fourth place and the special prize for the best bread were a fitting honor. France won by a point ahead of Luxembourg and the Netherlands. At the German Bakers Championship it was even closer. Believe it or not, half a point was enough to give Jürg Schmidt and Johannes Hirt victory. Both will be representing the German national team in the future. The final of the Eber Cup 2012 belonged to the confectioners. The German team competed against South Korea and Taiwan. The time frame was 12 hours to prepare the stipulated specialities. The pressure is incredibly high. You are in an unfamiliar environment, the temperatures and humidity are different. Your every step is under scrutiny. You are working under very different conditions than in your own company, your own bakery. It was the first international competition for Michael Stahl and Sebastian Nietzsche. They summed up their achievements with appropriate realism. We gave the best we could. Today we produced the best performance possible from all our samples. We couldn't have done any better. The team from South Korea won against Taiwan and Germany with a showpiece completely made from icing and consistently top scores for chocolates and petit fours, etc. They may now call themselves the unofficial confectionery world champions until the next EBA in 2015.